hard is addiction to treat? And why are more pe some people more successful than others? Well, with any chronic disease, a lot of it, there's a short piece of treatment. So when someone has a heart attack, they might be sent to the hospital and they get some sort of treatment. Mm -hmm. But the success is in what happens after with what are they doing with that right. chronic disease, with high blood pressure, with um, diabetes. This, you know, there's an episode of treatment, right. but then the success is what happens daily afterwards. And we at Hazelton Betty Ford are part of that episode of treatment. So we would do a lot of education, therapy, um, getting people connected with other people that they can relate to. But a lot of it is what happens afterwards, afterwards. When they go into the community, how can we prepare people to get active in community groups that can support them in their mm -hmm. ongoing recovery. Is that support and those groups crucial too? Absolutely. And people find them in different ways. Some people may find them by diving into their their work and, and finding a community there. Others may find them in their neighborhood communities. Others right. may find them in their faith communities. Others may find them in 12-step communities like Alcoholics Anonymous or Narcotics Anonymous. Mm -hmm. But as human beings, we can have a crisis, you know, like an overdose or something, and then we get back, we go to treatment, and we get back in life, and we kind of forget how bad it was. Those communities that focus on recovery help remind us that, oh, I need some support mm -hmm. as I go through daily life year after year. Right, absolutely. Mm -hmm.